Flame to Fame, what do you do? So we are a social company, we are producing gear and accessories from uh, recycled materials and we produce in workshops for people with special needs. Fantastic, something that's pretty close to my heart, upcycling and making sure that jobs are available for everybody. You told me just off camera that you started as a project but now it's a, an actual business and you're, you're yes. selling everywhere. So it started as a project because I wanted to have a base strap made out of fire hose material. And, um, nobody... Do you have one? Sorry, just yeah, to stop your story because yeah. let's see something. Fire hose material, the yes. foyer Foyer Foyer, exactly. So um, I, I desperately wanted to have a, a base strap from fire hose material, but no one, no one wanted to make it for me. So um, I went to a fire department, picked up some fire hose material, went uh, to, to, to a specialist and he made me my first strap. After that, friends, family, acquaintances came and said, we would like to have one as well. So suddenly I, I stood in front of a few orders. And uh, at that point, um, I connected with some other partners and we decided to, to make a project out of this. And we decided that the production will be in workshops for people with special needs. And we're taking care about recycling and upcycling. Fantastic. Do you just make straps? No. We ah, right. <laughs> what else have you got, Chris? A bass and a guitar. Okay, so you've got the bass, I've got the, the guitar, right? Hang on. That is the guitar. Um, that's the bass. And that's, and that's the bass. And it's, it really is coffee beans. So, yes, uh, this is a spent coffee ground. So this is chopsticks over here, also in the neck, as you can see here. This is spent coffee ground. And this is jeans. So it's a guitar and a bass completely from recycled materials. So that's, is that also fire hose as the strap, or what's that? That's fire hose as well. Yes, that's one of the, the, the fire hose um, uh, examples that we have. And uh, yeah, it's, it's still a prototype, but yeah. we're currently talking to a few companies uh, in order to make a, a mass production out mm -hmm. of this. And our aim is to produce a recycled guitar below a thousand euros. See, Chris is very good at his job because he's answering all the questions before I get to ask them. That's amazing. So if you do really want to support something that's good and back in the guitar world again, then flametofame.com. You should go there. There'll be a link in the video description. Um, you have lots of people with you. Do any of them play guitar? Yes, yes. Uh, so, for example, my son, who is just running around and looking for additional gear that uh, maybe I will have to buy then later on. Uh, so, uh, yes, we, we all play guitar. I play bass and um, others are playing guitar piano and so on. So we are, we are a team of musicians coming from normal business life, but started this because we thought that the music industry, music instrument industry needs uh, recycling and should also look for, for people who are not as fortunate as we are. That's great. So please support flametofame.com and the company. Uh, really nice to meet you. Thank you for grabbing me. Thank you. I think I should grab your son and he should do some playing. We can hear one of the guitars in the bass now. <laughs> So if you want more from the Guitar Summit 2022 playlist, you can see that also on screen now. I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.